Hey guys, it's me, Carrie, and I have a quick lip, I guess, balm or lipstick. I guess this is more of a lipstick review for you. I went to Christmas tree shops with my mom, and it happens to be in an outlet center. So before I even looked around Christmas tree shops, I ran to Bath and Body Works because I had a coupon for a free um, body care item up to $7.50. So this is what I chose. I love that now these coupons tend to be high enough that you can also get a fine fragrance mist because they used to be that you can only get the gel or the lotions, at least the coupons I got. They said, some of the cashiers have said there's different tiers and depending on how much you spend, you may get a higher value. And I got ones for a long time that were 50 cents shy of the fragrance mist because they're usually more. But luckily it was any up, item up to 750 um, in the body care and this was 750. So it is coconut cream pie. And it smells so good. I just spritzed one of the little testers in the store and um, and like kind of stuck it under my mask. But it smells so good. They also still have strawberry. Is it strawberry shortcake? It may not be strawberry shortcake, but it's strawberry some kind of cake. And that one is amazing too. I actually, oh, I have one in my purse that I could check. Um, they just changed strawberry pound cake fragrance mist. This is a really, really good one. And um, I love it so much. They just changed the packaging on it. They do still have this one as well. So if you have that coupon and you're looking for a fragrance mist, I think both of these are fantastic. I highly recommend them. But anyway, to get to the lip products, once I went back to Christmas tree shops, they have a clearance section in this one particular store in the beauty area. And there's often things in the bins that are marked down either 50% off or 75% off the lowest ticketed price. Now, these items are not ticketed. So whatever the lowest price is that it scans at, they take the discount off of that. So it's already discounted. So it's like a double discount, which is amazing. This is an Essence lipstick. And I got one from Ulta a couple of years ago. I want to say it was Kiss the Unicorn, maybe. They're, um, they're basically color changing. And this one is Kiss the, Kiss the Black Sheep. And it was 75% off. And then you'll see, like it says here, cashier price override code three. So whatever it scans at, they take an additional 75% off. So I got this for, wait for it, 44 cents. I know, that's crazy. Because I'm pretty sure these sell at Ulta for like four bucks. The other one I bought, I think was on clearance for whatever reason or sale for like, I wanna say it was less than $2 for sure, but it was a while ago, so I couldn't tell you for certain. And of course I'm trying to obsessively peel this sticker off perfectly, but I can clean it up later. I should just get it open. But um, I do want you to see the cute little sheep on it then. But these, like I said, they're color changing. I don't know if they're technically considered mood lipsticks, but the consistency, like texture wise, it feels more like a balm to me. So I feel like it's a tinted lip balm, but it's pretty well, it, it's like pretty well pigmented. So probably more color than I guess a typical, as I'm still sitting here obsessively scratching off the sticker. Um, it's probably more color than a typical tinted lip balm. So they do actually call it lipstick, but there it is again. If you can see, Kiss the Black Shape Lipstick. And that it shows you, it goes from a black lipstick to like that, like basically the color of the bottom of this. So anyway, let's look. There it is. It is indeed black. I will swatch it on my hand first. I'll do my usual one, two, three swipes. Right now, I really don't see anything, but I feel like it's starting to change a little bit. You can see like the slightest tint of a frosty pink if you look, you can kind of see the line right there. Let me try it on the lips and see if it's more noticeable. I don't know why I'm suddenly doing three swipes on my hand. Oh yeah, you can immediately see it change color on the lip. I should have done one and left one, but Oh yeah, you can definitely see the difference. It feels like a balm. It feels super moisturizing like a lip balm. And there is the color. Doesn't look like this. It's definitely more of a reddish kind of a color, but not like red red. Like it's still pink, but it's like a dark pink. 
it actually feels like it's still getting darker. I mean, that is pretty damn pigmented and it's definitely not this color. Well, maybe not too far off, I don't know. But I like it is the point. We'll do a little pucker on my, on this hand, see if you see anything. Not really, a little bit, you can kind of, yeah, you can kind of see my lips on there. But this was such a deal for 44 cents. I mean, come on, like, would any of you not gotten this? I don't think so. <laughs> for 44 cents, you would have gotten it. I mean, look at how cute it is just with the little black sheep on it. It's just the packaging alone. It does not have a scent. Okay, now you can see on my hand even more. See how over time it gets darker? You can definitely see that looks like this color on my lips. It definitely looks a little bit more of um, a reddish color, but I still really like it. It's not red red, it's like corally maybe red. It's definitely a warmer color than I thought it would be, but I think it looks okay. I happen to be wearing like a warm color top today with my little peach. I don't really own anything peach. I got this top at the same outlet center a few years ago. No, last year. My mom actually got a coupon because she's part of the Tanger Club. And if you spend certain amounts of money at different tiers, you get different rewards. And she got $10 off an item at Abercrombie, which I never shop in Abercrombie. For years, I was like, no, no. It was like, just, I wouldn't even go near it because they made everything in small sizes and they they fat shamed and they made anyone that was bigger than like a size 12 feel like they were obese and they were awful and horrible and I hated them but um we had the ten dollar off coupon so I said ah I guess we'll just go look and see and I'm pretty sure that this which is a hoodie mind you with the little kangaroo pockets oh and I can see my fat flesh um I think this was like fifteen dollars or twenty at the most so for ten bucks for a hoodie and I was very happy to say they did have bigger sizes. This was an extra large. I think this is an extra large. I can't tell now. But um, the girl who rang me up was a bit bigger than I was. And she, I would assume Abercrombie is a place that makes the employees wear their clothes. So I was like, okay, they're, they're opening their minds to the fact that women come in all sizes. And there should be no shame. No skinny shame. No fat shame. No anything in between shame. All of us are beautiful, even though I beat myself up over my weight all the time. I need to stop doing that. But, um, yeah, so anyway, so I'm wearing a warmer color top today, which is very atypical for me. But, yeah, I like this color. Definitely very, very pigmented. And it does, and I mean, you can see on my hand, too, like I said, it definitely gets darker the longer it's on. But for 44 cents, so worth it. So I doubt you were going to find this at a Christmas tree shop. However, I'm pretty sure that they restock these in the essence area of Ulta. Maybe not the black sheep, maybe not the unicorn, but this style of lipstick, I'm pretty sure they had a couple other animals too and that they will probably be restocking. I don't know for sure, because like I said, I bought it there a few years ago probably. At least I, yeah, it was before 2020. So yeah, a couple of years ago. But even for two bucks or three bucks, I would have paid that for this because this is really, really a great color and it feels so good on the lips. It's so moist. It's so not, not the slightest bit of stickiness. Just really, really feels good. Um, the only drawback obviously is right now we have to wear masks. So obviously I wouldn't wear it when I'm going out, you know, and have to be masked up. But for around the house, it feel pretty cute. So anyway, I know this is more than just a lipstick review, but I figured I'd share my day with you, and I'm having some of my Dunkin'. I haven't had a Dunkin' iced coffee in weeks, and I'm a member of T-Mobile Rewards, and actually, if you're a T-Mobile customer, look into T-Mobile Tuesdays. You can get free coupons for different items, depending on the week, every Tuesday, but they release different stuff. And last week they happened, or the week before, no, I think it was last Tuesday. They had a um, $2 gift card for Duncan, so I got two bucks off of my drink, so score. <laughs> but anyway, thanks for watching. I'll probably come down in a little while and read because my mom is out, so it's quiet in the house right now and do the next chapter of Homecoming. But until then, I will be back soon with more stuff. Bye, guys.